you. There we go. Okay, let's try again. Let's try again. Let's try the couple of things that I had ideas for for improvement. Did I get this again? No, I missed it this time, really. Uh, that surprises me a little bit. Yeah, who knows. Any number of things could have gone wrong there. Oh, that still made it. Okay, I was worried about that. <clears throat> oh, and it did work this time! Okay, cool. So yeah, standing... Standing, what am I saying? Uh, just like how mashing triangle on old wrinkle at the start lets you move through the text boxes in the first area of the tutorial. Mashing triangle on the weapons guide lets you run through those boxes. That's good to know. And yeah, this is now faster than, uh... Oh, no, I shouldn't compare. <laughs> I shouldn't compare to what I did last run. I keep forgetting last run, I, I lost like six seconds on the opening cutscene. <laughs> Not exactly, not exactly comparable. I've said it a few times, but I love the carpet in this area. The space carpet with the asteroids and moons and stuff, it's so pretty. Oh, nope, that's not the right one. Can we get the sub three? Gosh, I hope so at that rate. <laughs> Very nice. I guess these loads are kind of long. I, I can imagine FDS saving a good chunk of time in this. It, it just needs to be tested. I, once I have a run I'm happy with, I should just do a run with FDS and not submit it. Or just do a bad run with FDS and compare loads. That's all that really needs to happen. Part of the, the problem also with load timings in PS1 games is so much of it can just depend on your individual console rather than anything um, like determined by the game, if that makes sense. Like I said, on, on Jersey Devil we did try to standardize load times. But the problem we ran into with that is, even on the same disc, on the same console, load times can just vary over the course of multiple runs. It's a really unfortunate thing about PlayStation speedrunning. I like these games so much, but, uh... Yeah, that fact just kind of hanging over everything can make it a little bit of a bummer. Okay, let's try this idea. Drown for iframes. Gosh, if that saved time, it saves barely any time. 
I am not so sure about that one. That seems too far left. Nope, it's fine. That seems too far left, he says, going for it anyway. I think another thing that I, I'd like us... Us, I, I don't know who us is in this sentence, but I, I'd like to try to work out more is just... Oh yeah, you totally can go around that corner sharp. Good to know. Okay. I've been doing that super slow. Uh, some of the bosses are really weird. <laughs> I have gotten extremely quick kills on a few bosses a single time, and I don't get it. <laughs> The, uh, the dragon boss, the... I can't remember any of the terminology in this game. The, like, shadow knight boss of this area. Uh, I've had it before where he just doesn't warp for almost the whole fight. <laughs> no clue why. Sure would be nice if he'd do that consistently, though. Because, <laughs> I mean, if we could figure out consistent boss manips, that's... I mean, on all the bosses, at least like a minute over the course of the run. jumps close to a platform, you can pin him in a corner. Interesting, interesting. I really should plug in a memory card sometime and make some practice saves for this game. I don't... I don't entirely mind the way that I practice right now, because the game is short enough that just playing up to the point where I want to practice something means that I'm just getting a lot of early game practice in, and that's not a bad thing. I've, I've tried doing that approach for a few speedruns before, and they are not runs that I got particularly good at, but I it's an enjoyable way to practice the game, at least, for me. But, obviously it's not very efficient. And I should really put this game, load up this game in BizHawk sometime and play around with hacking some things. I want to see what happens if you leave the, uh, the tutorial with the crossbow without giving it back. It would be cool if we could use the crossbow on the first bus or something to save a bunch of time there. But I don't know. I don't know what happens. Maybe if we leave the tutorial, they just... Don't let us progress with the game if we didn't return the weapons. I don't know. <laughs> I need to research things. Skip fire.
yeah, always. It's so funny to me how consistent that is. I keep feeling like I'm gonna fail it any time, and I, I haven't. It's just, it just keeps working. Oops. Hey now. Yeah, you, it just it just works every time. You know, manly. Hope you are well. Kingsley, please, oh, goodness. thing is I'm not entirely sure if I want to go out of my way to collect lives like that or if I want to route in a game over at some point. <laughs> this doesn't feel right. No, oh, it worked. Because I mean some game overs can be pretty fast and it just brings you right back up to five lives. Assuming you do it in the right place. But I don't know, I... That would involve more thought than I have currently given it. <clears throat> and yeah, it would be a really dangerous route to go low on lives. It would be the kind of thing where you suddenly need everything to go right. There we go. Um... That was unfortunate, but I do get... Do get more more health coming up. Yo, golf. I mean, double foxy just in that it is the fox again. How are you doing, golf? How's your day been? Just got home. Very nice. I'm glad you're home. That's much better than hearing you're on break and will not be home yet. Uh, and I'm not in a position to try a bad trick, so I'm just gonna smack that guy. Overtime again. Again for cleaning. Weird. Is cleaning often the reason for you doing overtime golf? I don't feel like I hear about that very much. That's true, I don't. That's that's entirely true. hits on you. That's really unfortunate. This was really bad. <laughs> Oops. I, um... I just need to run into the lava here. I, I don't really... I don't really have another choice. I'm pretty sure this enemy does a full heart of damage every time. I need to get better at fighting that strong enemy. Clearly. Cleaning is never the reason. Strange. That's 
fine. What? That's unfortunate. Uh. There we go. Actually, I really probably don't even need those hearts. Perfect. I mean, not the run up to this point, but that fight. I... I'm not gonna bother trying to estimate how far behind I am. I, I don't think there's much reason to. Well, I'll just keep going. I've got a lot of time to save, obviously. I am minutes off of the record. I should not be too concerned about... 30 seconds here, 30 seconds there. Another few here's and there's, and I should be concerned, but... Not yet. Not yet. here. <laughs> Dang. I wonder if it's worth... Actually, you know what it might be worth is hitting this switch right now and then going back for a box. I was gonna say, I wonder if it's worth running ahead to, uh, to that box and then going back for the middle switch. Might be, might be. Yeah, there's so many, so many nice skips we have, and, and all that stuff, and I do actually kind of want this life. Come on. There you go. Meep, meep, meep. And I have been doing a bunch of practice and ignoring the Shadow Knight, so I do have to remember to go back to Seaport and do that one. Cannot forget. <laughs> Horns, I don't think this question is really on the Zando Toaster ballot right now. Why are you asking me this? an investigative journalist. You know what? Fair enough. My answer is yes. Same-sex marriage should be legal. Thank goodness it is. At least in this country. With the takes? What takes? 
I don't feel like that's a particularly hot take these days. <laughs> You're right, it's not a hot take, it's just a take. You're right, you're right. Hey, I'm also not sure about this area. I... Did I just... Really, you can just jump right over that. That's good to know. Don't jump when coming into this room. I was gonna say, I don't know that it's worth fighting any of these guys. You can go into the boss with a decent amount of health. I, uh... I have died in this boss before because of that, but I don't know. I don't know. are full of precariously placed teetering shards of nitroglycerin. Don't jump when coming into this room. <laughs> thank you, thank you, Radicoon. Have a good night. Glad you could stop by for a bit, and thank you again for, for making the tutorial that you made. It was very nice, very good. Horns, I have a question for you. Should Day's Bag of Bones be legal? Should peanut butter be outlawed, or is it probably fine the way it is? Uh, I think it's probably fine the way it is. I think that it certainly could be outlawed. If anything's gonna get outlawed, you know, peanut butter would not be the worst thing. Um, but I think it's probably fine, and if nothing needs to be outlawed, we don't need to go... go poking around at peanut butter for that. I think Day's Bag of Bones himself should be legal, but you think dazing someone by hitting them with a bag of bones should be illegal in most contexts. Good news, I think it is. <laughs> My health is not very good right now. What am I gonna do about that? Anything? Do I care? No, I- Ah, uh, wait, how much- How much damage do those guys do in that room early in Dungeon 3? Is it two hearts? It might be a heart and a half. I might be okay. I might be okay. Do I think Day's Bag of Bones should be legal? Hey, I'm not... I'm not the one under question here. Yo, Gwen. They might kill me. We'll see. We get to find out. This is an adventure now. I think there's a chest of hearts that's, like, super easily accessible in the next room, but I don't need it. I think it's at the other corner of the room, anyway. <laughs> okay, big rhino guys. 
We're fine. We're fine. We are golden and fine. <laughs> Have a good night, Orns. Stay golden and fine, Horns. I tried kicking way too soon there. Stay gold, pony boy. continued saying the phrase stay gold pony boy significantly longer than I remembered anything about the plot of the outsiders that is a book that I read in middle school could not tell you anything about it anymore other than that sentence is in it am I used to the controls now I feel pretty good with the controls yeah I, one of the games that I have spent the most time running also has tank controls, where you want to spend a large portion of the game strafing. So I did not feel much issue with the controls to begin with. Uh, there was a little bit of a learning curve to it, but for the most part, they felt pretty good right away. I haven't seen Kingsley go on top of that gate like that, that was interesting. They dye their hair, that's all you remember. Slightly more of it than me, but not much. Also, I think that boss fight is really funny. I'll stay gold in the chorus is what you were quoting, gotcha. I remembered liking the book, maybe I should read it again sometime. Imagine, imagine reading a book. I do not need the crossbow right now. It is also empty because I did not go to the tutorial. So I have no leftover ammo. It's all good, hip hop. Or whatever your name is. Hopgood? I think it's Hopgood is the one standing out there. alternate universe where hip-hop music is called hop good music I'd not to do a cosplay of the winner of survivor season five. Oh my god where am i going where am i going horns go to bed <laughs> i trust you that the joke is good i trust you what am i doing on health I'll find out when I get in there. I think I should be fine. I took a damage going in. I should be fine. I've got like four hearts. Yeah, I've got four hearts. didn't run straight into a wall that time. How about that? That's nice.
Oh, my phone buzzed. I wonder what that's about. Oh, I know what that's about. Never mind. It is something I can look at later. Okay, scary dungeon time. Still on four hearts, I believe, so I should be able to uh, tank a little bit of damage here in this room. Take a hit from that guy. Hop over this guy, drop down, and take a hit from this guy. Or miss that guy, that's fine too. why we've kept these keys this whole time. Okay, this jump is one of the ones I'm worried about the most. It's a weird one. Okay, we got our first try, that's good. And then I have also been worried about this jump, but I started getting it... I started finding some semblance of setup for it. Come on. Come on. Heck. That is not the setup. I want to run into the corner and get in a position such that holding strafe does not... There we go. That's it. Such that holding strafe does not push me out of the wall. And then I want to walk forward and before Kingsley starts running, do a jump. Also, this is what the other key is for. That's that's why we've had those this whole time. And then this room is why I wanted to be low on health. Come on, jump to your death. Not quite. I'm not so sure that jump is gonna happen. How am I doing on lives? I have like three left? Three left, okay. And then there's one more room, and I do want to switch to the crossbow, but I can do that in the next room. Does not need to be here yet. There's also another out of bounds I was looking at in this room where once you are out of bounds it's faster to get to the room's exit, but the out of bounds takes a lot longer to set up, but I'm not sure that it's worth it. Perfect. Next room is the long one. Okay, it's a long one. It's not the room I was thinking of. And I think... I actually want to just hold on to these arrows. I think I'm good. I've been getting an arrow pickup at the start of this room, but I don't think I need it. Like, I think if I'm coming in here with nine, I should be fine. Oh, 
darn. That is quite unfortunate. We are uh, going to be slow and in danger. <laughs> Ooh. Just take this. We're okay. We're okay. Don't worry so much. <sighs> and then the next room is a scary one. The next room's the one where you need to just go, go, go. No, it's not. It's the room after this. <laughs> or it's the room after that? I don't know. I don't know the order of this dungeon at all. Goodness gracious. Extremely badly on health. That's how I'm doing on health. You know, I'm not sure I ever realized you can strafe while you have the shield up. That might be the first time I've done that. Audio acquired. What is up, Lucas? Lucas, we are on an okay speedrun right now. This run, you would not believe how okay it is. It is pretty good, minus like a minute, minute and a half in Dungeon 2. Time learning today, and the last thing you did was the sequence break jump. The one... the one in this homeworld? The post-Dungeon 4 one? This is where we need to just run. Over the river, yeah. Heck yeah. Ding! Lucas! Nice. Congratulations. Oh, I almost died. <laughs> Very good. Okay, where are we? And how much health do we have? Two hearts still? Are we where I think I am? No, we're not. We're almost where I think I am. Oh, I forgot there's a health pick up here! Oh, that makes this so much more reasonable. I keep forgetting that's there. Um, okay, that is good to know. That is good to know. Oh, Kingsley. Okay, we are actually fine to do the thing that I was thinking about. Uh, I don't think that's safe. Especially not if I... Oh, it still is, really! Incredible. And then follow this down! Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. <laughs> I should wait. I should wait, I was right. I should have waited again! <laughs> Heck. Are you allowed to complain in the stream? Absolutely. This game goes for $100? Yeah. Yeah. I picked it up at a game store for something in that range. <sighs> Do I want to go for something really risky that if I miss is probably going to kill me and if I get will save like 25 seconds? <laughs> This run's already not great, I might as well go for it. There's no reason not to. I got lives, it's not like I'm about to game over. Yeah, Lucas was a Kingsley fan before it was cool. Yeah, I'm dead. Actually... Um, wait. I, I thought that would kill him. <laughs> Sorry, I suppose missing it, I still have a backup there. I, I don't need to worry that much. 
Come get me. Yeah, that's what I thought. You saw a campaign ad on TV today? Ooh. Hmm. Yeah, that election did already happen, didn't it? Oh, heck, hold on. How do I do this? Oh, wait, I have health. Never mind. I, I thought I was on half a heart, not a heart and a half, I'm fine. Getting your daily scam texts from random international numbers. I've been getting scam texts frequently too, I wonder what's up with that. I did not know he could teleport into the same place. This guy, oh my god. Absolute trickster. <laughs> that was a really funny fight. Thank goodness this run was already dead. I, uh, I don't need any of those hearts. from middle of the room to middle of the room. It's so weird. Scam ding. And yeah, it turns out this game is easier when you skip a bunch of it. That's true. That's true. I've done most of the rooms in the game now. At some point, I do want to uh, properly go through and play play the levels as intended, but I'm good right now. That's not it. I have died here quite a few times. I really struggle with this. That was faster than I expected. And we still have lives, so I'm not even at risk of getting a game over in, uh, in the next uh, fight. Uh, yeah, we were talking about it a little bit. Just like what the issue is, any potential solutions. I, I'm i okay with allowing Duck Station to artificially increase load speeds. I know a lot of people in PS1 communities aren't, but I don't care about what those people want at the moment. <laughs> if, if FDS becomes a concern, I don't think there's anything wrong with making emulator competitive with PS2. Alternately, just ban FDS. We can. We make the rules. I, why did you go back to the crossbow? Oh, 
I'm a little worried, because his attacks do a lot. Oh, never mind. There's a heart here. I'm fine. I'm also cheating, so we're fine. <sighs> Almost. Okay, well, that's... I've heard there's that quick kill on this boss. I have not seen it until now. That's a neat one. <laughs> Yeah, I bet if I wasn't holding forward, I would have gotten it. Come on. There you go. turning the wrong way for this. We need to go this way. Yeah, I just did like a 300 degree turn coming out of there. That's that's not ideal. I love uh, Rosary Village's music. This song's so nice. It's a lot better than this song. This song isn't the worst. I don't hate this song. It's just not... Not as good as, as other ones. Standing on lava? Maybe I am. Kingsley is wearing some magic boots. Yeah, it is a little funny. way. Roughly. And don't soft lock. Please. Please don't just get stuck on a building. Oh, too much. Turned too far. There's a soft lock there? I don't know if there is, but Kingsley did get stuck on a building for a second. I can imagine there being points to soft lock there, that's all. Everybody's cheering. Everybody loves Kingsley now. He's a true knight! Look at him, he's dancing! 
He's so happy? Let's go Kingsley. Live in the dream, honestly. Who doesn't want to be a true knight? Yes. Yes, he does. I like that. And I will not fall into the volcano this time, like I did on my last attempt here. Three hearts. I'm not doing great on health. This fight could go well if I don't take any hits, and if I do take some hits, it can go really bad <laughs> and make me sad. So we'll see. We'll see what happens. Bad custard, I swear to god. Just come over here. Also, this song is definitely busted, Anna. No! No, Bad Custard, please. Please don't. Why are there no hearts here? Oh god. Oh god. Oh god, oh no. Oh no, oh god. <laughs> uh, oh? Oh, really? Where are you going, bad custard? My heart is broken. <laughs> that was so dumb. <laughs> oh, that was so dumb. <laughs> also, there is a heart in here. It seems to be at the top of the arena above everything else. What is that? Who decided that? I shouldn't have taken that elevator I saw, that was slow. <sighs> Dude, just take the hit! Just take the L! Bad Custard, I'm gonna win, you know I am! I didn't even know he could block. So funny. Can someone do me a favor and tell me what the world record is? 
I know I was about to beat it if I didn't die. I don't know how high of a 56 it is, if this is still technically on pace. Oh, right, I am on the top level. Thirty-six. Okay, so I'm not about to beat it. It's close! It's really close! It is comically close, given what happened this run. There we go. Forty-two. That's so dumb! <laughs> I mean, I can't be too mad. I've done like six runs of this game. <laughs> yeah, I have another. I have another Jolly Rancher. Yeah, I guess I might as well. I've got the time. That, uh... That run changes my views on how far I can take this. Because I was thinking, like, oh, if a run where everything goes basically right that would be, like, a 54. Um, but this was a pretty bad run that was almost a 54. A low 54, too. I don't think we're quite at sub-50 yet, but, like, a 51, I think, uh, I think would be, be pretty reasonable. run it back. I know, right, Rachie? I was thinking that too. 